People who live in Racine have been blessed with programs and services by the Racine Dominican Sisters for more than a century. From housing for abused women to a retreat center, they truly live their mission of being committed to truth and compelled to justice. The Racine Dominicans know that their service goes beyond what they do in the city. They're also providing a special service out here in the country. Opened in 2004 in the town of Caledonia, the Eco Justice Center includes a barn, house, and education center, powered in part by renewable energy. Students from San Juan Diego Middle School in Racine love coming here for field trips. We get to like meet animals, we learn new things every time. We learn about how to make sure we can save the planet, how to reuse, reduce, recycle. Look at this. <laughs> Look at this big egg. These students, along with about 3,000 other people who visit every year, work with Sister Janet Weicker. Are you worried about the smell? The smell won't hurt you. Come on in. A trained teacher and artist who grew up on a farm, Sister Janet sees hands-on education as part of the focus for creating this center of community, contemplation, creativity, and cultivation. So many children are raised with a disconnect from nature and they have no idea where their food comes from. They think it comes from the store. Did you all get a chance to feel how warm that egg is? They're awed by this whole interconnection of nature and their lives and how dependent we are on animals and plants for our living. <laughs> Along with the chickens and ducks, they raise alpacas and offer classes in weaving and knitting. Sister Janet works diligently with local businesses, We Energies, and helpful volunteers to develop and operate the center, often using innovative technologies that you wouldn't expect on a simple farm. By using renewable energy, whether it's uh, a solar energy or geothermal, reduces our carbon footprint on the earth. It's also a financial decision. The center generates enough of its own energy that the total utility bill for the entire property is under $700 a year. But environmental stewardship is what drives Sister Janet. Every creature, whether it's an ant or a bee or a goose, is an expression of God's love for us and a facet of God's beauty. As a part of our faith, we need to respect and praise God for all of creation. And by trying to live a simple, sustainable lifestyle and teaching others about it is a way of living out this, uh, giving glory to God and recognizing the beauties of God's creation. The Eco Justice Center is always looking for more volunteers and visitors. I'm Barbara Haig reporting.